Today on our 2014 Nissan Rogue Select, we'll be installing the Kurt 1 quarter inch receiver dupe hitch, part number C12122. To begin the install, we'll first need to remove the old or manufacturer's tow hooks. As you can see here on the passenger side for our application, it has a total of four attachment points. These attachment points are well nuts built into the frame by the manufacturer, so we'll need to remove the four bolts. We'll set the bolts and the tow hook aside as it will not be reinstalled. Now with the tow hook out of the way, we're going to reuse the manufacturer's well nuts for our two attachment points here on the passenger side. On the driver's side, we're going to have a total of three attachment points. Again, we're going to reuse the manufacturer's well nuts as attachment points. Now, before we attempt to install the new hardware, over time these well nuts will build up with rust, dust, dirt, and debris and can make it difficult to install the new fasteners. We recommend to clean them out first and to do that we're going to use a spray lubricant and a half inch nylon tube brush part number 814092 to thoroughly clean those threads out before we attempt to install the new fasteners. Then once we have the threads cleaned out, take one of the new 12 millimeter bolts and thread it into the weld nut to make sure it'll go nice and easily. Now we know our fastener will go, we'll go ahead and repeat the same process for the other two fasteners. Note, as we do not need to clean out the weld nuts on the passenger side, because we had the two fasteners that were securing the tow hook in those weld nuts. To install the hitch, we'll use the new 12 millimeter bolt and half inch conical tooth washer. The teeth of the washer will face the hitch, going through the hitch attachment point and into the weld nut. We have a total of five attachment points, two here on the passenger side and three on the driver's side. We're now ready to put our hitch in place. We'll feed the passenger side up over the exhaust first and then bring our driver's side into position. As we install our fasteners, we'll install each fastener finger tight until we have them all in place. Once we have our fasteners installed, we'll go ahead and tighten them down. Next, we'll go ahead and torque the specifications as indicated in instructions. Now with our hitch secured and torqued to specifications, we're ready to hit the road. Now to complete the install of our Kurt Class 2 one and a quarter inch receiver tube hitch, part number C12122 on our 2014 Nissan Rogue Select. <laughs> 